stay in California, which is saddening and depressing. And of course, I enjoy the depression and enhance it by listening to a song by Megan Tangens. Tangen? Tangens? Tangens. There we go. Named O Father. For those of you that know, I have major fucking issues with my dad. Um, my father wasn't exactly a good man, and we stopped being in each other's lives um, about almost eight years ago. Nine years ago, give or take. Um, my father was not a very good man, and as a 30-year-old woman, it affects you. To not have a dad in your life really kind of sucks. And the only person that is even half that weight of a father is my godfather who is probably one of the best people in the world, but works so damn much that I don't get to see him often enough. So, with this all being said and done, I ended up telling him that I wanted to move. Now, my godfather is probably the most supportive fucking man in the world, but this is a man that I've told, said this numerous times in videos and stuff, that he flew from, oh, that he flew all the way from Mexico to come to dance at the father-daughter dance for my sweet 16. I don't know about you, but that says something. And that's a lot for a girl. Now, unfortunately, that's all I have. Since he lives in Mexico City, not Mexico, Cancun, and a whole bunch of different things, it's kind of hard to really have him around. They really can't. I mean, he takes care of, honestly, he takes care of what he needs to take care of. He's a, a busy man, and he works in the Mexican soccer league, so I really can't be upset, even if I wanted to be. But, is a man who I value his opinion very much. I want to accept any idea I have. I don't know, when you have an absent parent, I guess it makes you wonder, who's really there for you? So thank you, Megan Tanches, for inspiring me to write a song about my situation. If you're watching, I will tag you on Facebook because I will. Oh, God. <laughs> and thank you for making great music. Fuck. Right here in the car. Was supposed to be here two hours ago. Two hours ago? What the f- I called you. <laughs> when did I call you, Mr. I Kathy? had to take care of some stuff. Which you should have prefaced. Then I get a text message. I and did. I told you what I was going to do. And my memory doesn't work that well. You should know that you have to reiterate with me. My memory doesn't work that well either. I wonder fucking why. <laughs> <laughs> so then... This, God damn it, G. This dick. <laughs> then now calls me. An hour ago, and says, I have to go to the bank and do some shit. I'll be there soon, I promise. We won't hit traffic. It is I now, didn't. he called me and texted me at fucking 11 30, 12. It's now two. I still love you though. <laughs> I was gonna give you shit one way or another on or off camera, you know that. You really think I was gonna give you any crap? I could only be so lucky. Left turn, eh? Anyway, this is my last day here, which is very upsetting. Yes. But this only means that I am going to be back in uh, another six months to move here. How do you feel about me being a California resident there, bud? I'm actually pretty fucking excited, to be honest. So all we need is Leanne, and then we're good. Yes. All we need is fucking Allie to move up here, too. That'll be fucking great. Yo, Allie, this is from me and Austin. Fucking move, move here. To California. It yeah. is great. I know you love your father, but, you know, you could be my roommate. Speaking of Southern California, I had a white girl moment. And I realized Long Beach has gangs. <laughs> yes, it does. And Surprise. I'm a, and I'm a white looking, white. Well, I'm a white Latina, but unfortunately I look like a gringo. Translation, I look like a white bitch. So, I don't know if me living in Long Beach is such a good idea, although I do want to live to, I want to live in California. I don't, I don't know. I don't, I don't know. I don't know if the crime rate is down or anything. I have to do some real research. But I, I had a scary white girl moment. I was afraid to go to sleep. 
We had a scary white girl moment. Yeah, I was ready to go sleep. I was like, I don't know if I should do this. I'm still moving here. Um, although I have a couple of friends from the Libra Nation saying, I'm moving to San Francisco. Wink, wink, nod, nudge. And I'm going, San Fran, he's cool. But it looks like it's expensive. Yeah, oh, fuck yeah. It's hella expensive. So then I started thinking when I move out here, What's the one fucking thing that you and I want been wanting to do since its conception of the of the 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 the, the what the what are they called the brothers? What? Hank and um. Hank and God damn it! Why is my fuck? I'm drawing blanks here too. But you know what event I'm talking about? No. Really? No, I don't. Fucking VidCon. Oh wait, you have mentioned VidCon. Shit. We're gonna head on to the highway and I'm going to totally bogart Austin's shit because he owes me that. Don't <laughs> lie, you do, you owe me that. I were you expecting to, were you expecting to us connect so much in person than we did online? I was actually going to say that Wait, didn't I mention this before? I was like, one of the things. Oh, you did that in I the video. In the video, you did. Yeah, one yeah. of the things that I noticed was. Um, I'm like that. You know, when you meet like somebody online, like, and you and you're talking to them online, and they're just really cool. Yeah. But sometimes you have those moments where you meet them in person, and it's just like. Did you what put on a show? Yeah. Yeah. But you're exactly what I thought you were going to be. Yep. Yeah. The G online is the G in person. A. I could totally make a fucking joke here, but I won't. Um, <laughs> it's okay, we can do it off camera. Oh dear, yeah, which, which is what we're gonna do anyway. We're gonna be right <laughs> we get up there. All right, uh, there's gonna be a lot of editing, and I don't wanna ruin the thing, but all right, let's see, so goodbye. Hi! So, we are at the Culver City Mall, and we're gonna see if we can get my nephew something. Um, I don't know how I feel, I've never, uh, this is a different kind of place. I, malls are, malls are malls, but this looks different. And I'm kind of excited. So, Seth, don't worry. Nancy's gonna get you something really nice to promise. Amada, I will never leave your son again until I leave a year, a year from now. You can really tell that I'm an out towner. <laughs> hot dog on a stick. What the hell is a hot dog on a stick? Exactly what it is. I am such an out of towner. And the, this is, you can see the, the entrance of where the mall is. It is the weirdest <laughs> thing. And I can't even begin to understand. And I can't, I'm flabbergasted right now. <laughs> I'm so New York right now, it's not even fucking funny. I can't even, I can't even begin to understand the bullshit. Dining car, that's what that is. Are you fucking kidding me? <laughs> I'm being such a basic white girl right now, I can't even. I re that's, I mean, I, I, I don't know how to react to this. I, I wish I did. I, I, I want to say, ooh, scenario. No, focus. Um, I want to say that I know what the fuck's up, but I'm going to lie because I don't. I mean, I'm let's be for real here. Oh my God, that's so scary to look at. And I'm afraid of heights. Look at this. This is like, I'm, I'm afraid of heights. And no, no, we're not walking up. Are we walking up? Oh God, I don't want to walk up just yet. I have to build up to this. There's fucking douchebags in front of me. Oh man, I remember oh, like my... years ago back Look at this. this. I remember you. See you later. Oh my god, <laughs> goodbye. It is Santa Monica. Hey. And now we're going to where? Third Street Promenade? We are at Third Street Promenade. Oh, I knew that. <laughs> That's the plan. Find something at Third Street. So this is basically like shopping in the city. I guess only there's, you know, beach stuff involved. And traffic is insane in here. Yeah. It's fucking insane. I don't think I've ever dealt with it. New York and Long Island has nothing like this, so <laughs> I thank you for that weird angle on my phone and God, uh, um, yeah. Oh my God, I'm gonna miss you. I'm gonna Ooh. miss you. Be careful. As I fall. You were saying we had a heartfelt moment that I fucked it up by being accident prone. Oh, I said that I'm gonna miss you too. I'm gonna miss you too. It's gonna be so great. Oh my God, I'm so excited. Third Street Promenade. I'm excited to see what the fuck I'm gonna find. Hopefully I'll find something for Seth. And if I don't, well, we can say I tried. Yeah, but See that in front of you? That's a Santa, Santa Monica Pier. Santa Monica Pier. And I'm gonna go there because this one's taking me. Yeah. Let's do this, let go. So we made it to the pier. And oh my fucking God. Look at this. <laughs> I don't know if you can see it. There's a coaster right the fuck there. This is Pacific Park. 
So we're gonna check that out a little bit. I'm in awe of this. You can tell I'm such an out of towner. I'm filming anything and everything I can see. Although Peter Burger does sound like a lot, bunch of fun. I'm just, and I've tripped twice on the pier already. Which, and this fucker <laughs> really laughed has. at me. Laughed at me. Because we're best friends. Yeah, we are. Hey. So, <laughs> I don't know. We'll see what happens. I'm going to find something for Seth here, maybe. So, what's the pier? This is the pier. Can you guys see that? I'm too afraid to ride that because we both know I'm afraid of heights. But I just want to do a 360 if I can with this. It's about what oh, the fuck's up. Nice. I'm just saying, I want little things for Sethi and Sophia. So, one and a two year old, this is, you know, probably not a good idea, but who cares? I'm the aunt. Hey. <laughs> I love you guys, and I'll see you tomorrow. Thank you so much for watching everything. I made the film when I get home, probably not, and he's doing with Saracha. Um, and we'll go back to normal life tomorrow, which sucks. I'm leaving. No. It's upsetting. As he pats my new hat. Oh, this is new? Yeah. Yeah, new. I'm stylish as fuck. Alright, I'll talk fuck. to you guys later. And, uh, yeah, okay. Bye!